Oh, hey everybody, I'm Blitz. Welcome to a game called Timberborn. This is one where you are like the leader of a beaver colony. Yeah, you heard that right. You're beavers and you build a beaver city. Look at the cute little dudes. Look at this city in the background. They built themselves a little dam there and they got a city on both sides. It's amazing. So check it out. There's a little beaver lodge. And <laughs> look at the little guys. They're so cute. Oh, look at this one. What's its name? Does it have a name? Oh yeah, Quarvan. I like him. Oh, Zulg. I can't really speak beaver very well. I don't know. Anyway, let's start building a path. We're going to start a dirt path over to the trees because everybody knows that beavers eat trees. That's like their number one thing that they do in the world. And then build dams across rivers, which we can do in this game. <laughs> Look at them go. They're building the path. They're so amazing. Look at the little fellas. Yes. You know what we can do? Let's actually add some more workers to this hut so we can get our work done faster. And then we're also going to build a... Let's see, where is it? Uh, yeah, right here. Manage cutting of the trees. And we're going to cut down this forest because that's what beavers do with themselves. Just like so. Yes, all of the trees will die. And we do have a lumberjack flag here. So our guys will start chewing up the logs as soon as the log pile is complete. Nice. 61%. And ta-da! We have a log pile. Come on, fellas. <laughs> They're going to waddle over to the trees. Why do they walk on their back legs? Seems a little weird. And then they're chewing on the trees, right? Come on, take those trees out. Take them down. Take them down. <laughs> Look at that little beaver over there. It's like, I wish I had something to do. I should probably give you something to do while well, these guys eat trees. So I'm going to build a dirt path over to these beautiful blueberry bushes. I guess beavers probably eat blueberries too. That'll work. And we'll put in a food and a gathering flag over here so our beavers will eat all of the berries. Just like so. Cool. We're also going to demolish this little barrier. And then the water will flow inside of this area and it'll be beautiful. Yes! They just chopped down the trees! <laughs> and they threw the log in there. How do beavers carry logs on their shoulders? I thought they just drug it through the water. These are weird beavers. There we go. Beaver bro is tearing down the barrier. So if I speed up time a little bit. There it goes. Oh, look! The water's flowing in. How cool is that? And they built a gatherer shack too. So we can start getting blueberries and get more food. Now that's very important because when the dry season does come... We won't have any access to food or water. So I'm going to have to start making a water pump here. I'm going to build that path like that and do that. And then we're going to build up a few water tanks here. <laughs> but they're all going to go to bed. They make these cute little beds, little sleeping mats. Yes. Wake up, little dudes. It's time to get to work. Build my water pump. Start making some water storage. Dry season comes fast. I'm also going to plan out a little bit of an area right in here. Yeah, like, like this probably. Make... All the way to the water and we're gonna put in a farm a farmhouse over here and then all of this is gonna be fields so I'm gonna plant crops we're gonna plant some carrots I don't really know how much to plant so I'm just gonna start I'm gonna plant some potatoes a buttload of them and then a bunch of wheat I don't know what to do with wheat it takes 10 days to grow though and then more carrots because the world likes carrots I think the first water structure is completed a little water tank Oh, my dudes are thirsty. That was good timing. Yes, crafting progress. Make that water work. Construction lacks materials. Looks like we need more logs. My dudes are lazy. Get to work. Get that get that tree chopping done. What I really want to do is pause these so we can start building that farmhouse. We have to have the planting done in this little tree here. I kind of feel bad for him. Okay, so they can get these trees down here, these trees over here, and like those two. So we might need another area over here for the guys to get more berries and more trees. Yes! The farmhouse just got completed. I need my two workers here. We don't have enough workers. We need to make more babies. Look! Quarvacon and Kneja. Katanaja has grown up. That's good. I still don't speak beaver. Now I do want you guys to make this water pump because I'm concerned about not having enough food and water for the dry season. Hey, look! Now they're planting our wheat. That's amazing. Go, little dudes. Get your wheat planted. I really need more people, though. Huh. Let's get rid of some builders so you guys can go work somewhere else. I think that's a good plan. All right, so next up, I feel like it's time to get some housing going on. We can start building some beaver lodges. Kind of like this area over here to build a few of them up. Let's do something a little bit different, though. How do I rotate the other way? We'll just do that. If I do, like, two here... And then I build a path between them. How many people stay in each beaver hut? We can also put in a campfire, which should make them happier, I would hope. 
And then if I do this around it, then we can put in additional lodges when we need them. And I don't know how many we need yet. We have 11 beavers. Okay, so a lodge can have two adults and one child. So if I have, I have 11 adults now, that means I need five huts. I can do that. Look, the first two little huts have been built. I love it. We don't have any babies. Um, everyone's an adult. And we have housing for four, so that's what it means there. I got this. I'm figuring it out. Uh-oh. We're also entirely out of berries. <laughs> they ate all the berries already. When are my potatoes ready? Oh, pretty soon. Carrots. Growth progress of the carrot seedlings, 96%. We'll have carrots today, boys. We'll be good to go. Food stockpiles, good. Water stockpiles at 207? That's amazing. I'm gonna pause this. We don't need anyone working there. And now we have three people without jobs. So I'm gonna add people to work here. Oh, do we have a baby? Your beavers are happier than ever. You have reached a new well-being high score of four. Wow, it's the nicest thing ever, anyone's ever said to me. They're gathering the carrots up. Oh, and then putting them into the stockpile house. That's cool. We have a capacity of 200. Explosives? We can have explosives? Oh yeah, I totally just found the inventor's hut. I don't even know what this does, but I'm gonna invent everything. That's probably where I get explosives out of. Decorations, we have monuments. Do I get a monument to myself? And there's power? Hot dang! What do we get here? The scavenger's hut to get metal? Ooh, what do we do? Oh, number five. Uh-oh, <laughs> somebody died. That's sad. Well, now I don't have to have many houses. And then there's a woodworking, a carpenter. Requires power to operate. Huh. I should figure that out. Let's plop in a power thing. Water wheel and power wheel. Beaver operated backup source of power. Ooh, interesting. Should be placed on a riverbank. Okay, like right here then? And I think I have to probably get the dirt path over to it. I don't know. I've never built a water wheel in my life before. Then I'm assuming the woodworking station goes next to it because I can run the power to it using the straight shaft, just like so. Weird. Oh, look at this. They're happier than ever. We made two babies and we're now level six. We need more babies. We need more babies. Okay, make that water wheel because it'll be fun. Interesting, potato is considered a material. That probably means I need to cook the potato. Is that in here? Uh, a grill, obviously, cooks potatoes. Workers, one, 25 logs. We'll slap that bad boy in right next to the old inventory. Even though I don't have enough people to invent things. You know what? We're gonna cut down the number of builders. And even make more babies. And they've chopped down almost all of the trees too. Hmm. I might need to expand up here. and <laughs> Kill more trees, because that's always fun. A log workery. Is that the name of it? I think I just made up a new word. Look, the water wheel is being made. Oh, that's so cool. Um, it's not doing anything yet because this isn't ready. Or, you know, the straight shaft. Does that require anything else? No, just logs. Okay, that'll be fine. Oh, hot dang, they're making babies like crazy. We got so many babies now. Four of them and 11 adults. We might need an additional house. We'll put that in and then why not two just to stay ahead? Because, well, frankly, we're, <laughs> we're right behind. Hey, look, they're all coming out of their lodges. That's adorable. Look at this one. He's cooking a marshmallow over a non-existent campfire. He's like, I am so ready for breakfast. That's awesome. Oh, I love that. Oh, we have 30 science now too. So cool. They're like, I have no power for this thing. I don't even know what I need logs for. Uh, needs power to operate. I got the power thing. Uh-oh, it's not connected. Why do I do things that I don't know how to do right? You know what I think I have to do? I think I have to build a dam on here. Then I can transfer the power on top of that. That's a lot of brain power. Yeah, that works. Huh. But before we do that, we got to get some trees. So will you fellas make some trees? How are you eating those? Oh, I told him to cut those down. Ah, that makes sense. So how am I doing? We've got 181 water. We have food and the berries are starting to regrow. So that's good. We're going to get more logs here. I kind of wonder... Okay, they are harvesting more stuff. It looks like wheat is another material. So I need more carrots too. I need less wheat and more carrots for right now. Oh, look at all that wheat. It's it's like harvesting itself right now. It's so cool. I'm guessing under the food thing, there's gonna be like a, yeah, a grist mill and then you can make a bakery and then I'll be able to eat bread. I didn't know beavers ate bread. Woo, level seven. My beavers love me. 
Okay, it looks like the dam has been built. And I think the thing on top of it is ready to be built. We have power. Then that means this thing goes. And then we have power here. Then it makes planks. I don't know what I need planks for. I just thought it'd be fun to have a water wheel. Let's just turn that off. <laughs> that, was, that was a waste of time. I'm so sorry, beavers. I didn't mean to. I'm honestly a little bit scared that we're not going to have enough water or food for dry season. Like, this dude is cool at the grill. He's got grilled potatoes. Why don't you have potatoes, bro? Your potatoes... Oh, you've grilled them all. You literally... You done grilled all the potatoes. I need to make less wheat. Ooh, what's that? A little package of dried out dyed wheat. I have too much. It's watered and alive. Yay! Nice, the carrots are being made too. I wish I could turn... Can I turn these off? That's too much wheat right now. Is it a good idea if I want to build a dam across here? I kind of just want to build a dam across there. Can I just build it? I'm going to do it. Oh, hey, I've got science, 102. Is there anything I really need? There was something in here, right? Yeah, stairs. I'm going to unlock that just because it's nice to have stairs. And then I think I could build on top of the houses. How does that work? Can I build a house on a house? Yes. Oh, weird. <laughs> you can make platforms, but I think I want to spread these out because there's work limits. So it'd be nice to have another area over here for my beavers to live. I kind of want to build a dam right through here or over here. This is another good area to live if I could get that flooded. Should we just go for it? I feel like we should just go for it. There's the campfire. Oh, a small warehouse. Oh, that's cool. All right. We're going to try to build a dam. It'll be fun. Oh, it's too far from the builder. Okay. If I build a builder's builder over here, build a, we're going to build a builder. I'm going to name it Bob. It'll be Bob the Builder. We have a problem, my dudes. The dry season. It's the dry season. I'm not looking forward to this. Dry season is, is the nemesis. Oh, what does this do? <gasps> Another little area to destroy. I like demolishing things. Yeah, buds, you got to get, you got to get all of this stuff out because it's going to dry out real soon. So we need to, yeah, we need to prioritize harvesting right now and prioritize carrots. Get all those carrots up. I wish I could put in more people. Oh, no. <laughs> Dry season happened. Oh, my water's gone. No, everything just dried out. Oh, no. Oh, it will, it'll die in 1.8 days. My bud's got to get it done. We need to increase the working hours to 24. They're already asleep, though. You will not sleep tonight, buds. You will... Oh, that one's still alive. Just kidding. I was clicked on that one. Oh, my word. What are they doing with the water? Why are they balancing the water around? Bunch of dorks. Yeah, they've, there's no water there. We have 98 foods. This is really sad. My entire world's dry now. Oh, what is this? What are these? What is that? A rune. Huh. Wow. There's runes all over the place. Was there other beaver civilizations before us? Yeah, there's that one little pond down here. Hmm. Come on, get that food. Get it. I think I have too much wheat. Do I not have... Oh, I don't have enough houses. <laughs> the beavers are just crashing here on... Oh, that's too bad. I'm going to make a house out here. It's right here. That's a good spot for a house. Actually, I want it over here instead. But I don't know what's going to happen with the dry season. And I think everything just dried out and died. That sucks. Okay, I don't want any of the wheat right now. Nope. No more wheat. I want carrots here instead. Oh, I know what it was. <laughs> it wasn't that they were um, they were just passed out on sleep because I was making them work 24 hours a day for like three weeks straight. <laughs> Sorry, fellas. Oh, but we got wet season back. So we've got that going for us. Oh, we're so close to having the dam constructed too. These little beavers are going to be so excited when they can walk across without swimming because I don't know why beavers like to walk and not swim. Oh, here comes the water. Ha <laughs> ha! Trees are back. Uh-oh. What's going to happen when it reaches the dam? Nothing. Until we... Oh, what happens? What happens if we completely dam the river up? Is it going to break everything? I'm kind of concerned. <laughs> Am I going to flood my beaver colony? Let's see. It's almost done. Oh, it is done. Why? What? Okay. It's working. Do they just walk across it? I think so. That's pretty cool. I like that. So I could build other things over here. Is there a way to dig? There's the landscaping. I'm guessing that's what the explosives are. From paper? 
What? There's not really a good area over here to do anything in. I thought the, the dam would maybe block things up. But the good news is we managed to survive the dry season. We had enough food and water. We have a couple beavers that don't have jobs, so I think it's time to give them one. So the levee blocks water completely. Other buildings can be built on top of it. If I build this... Boy, that's a bad idea. <laughs> Maybe we should just solidify the base that we have. Maybe that's a better idea. Because I kind of want to flood the world. That's what beavers do. Like, if we we could divert the water from this over here and then make it run around this side, that'd be cool. But it would also flood everything at this level. So we need a levee all the way around here, I guess? Oh, here's an idea. We can make a forester on the other side. I like this. I don't know what a forester does, but I want it. Plants, trees, and bushes. Ooh. Okay, there's a house there. So if I plant trees and bushes over on this side of the world, it could be cool. And then I'll build my road to it, like such as. And I could build a lodge or a few lodges over here in the derpy world. Ooh, so check this out. The forester needs planks, which is what we're getting right now. Ow! That's so cool. Oh, that dude's hungry. I'm so sorry, bro. I didn't know you were hungry right now. And then we're building the forester up. They're making the planks. That's so cool. Nice. The forester has been created. Nobody wants to work here, though, because nobody lives on this side of the map. That's why we have to have houses. That also means I can plant a buttload of trees. Birch trees. Um, is that what gives us nine days? Ooh, two logs from pine. Okay. And then maple trees. Oh. 24 days to grow, but I get eight logs from it. That's kind of sus. Let's, uh, let's plant some pines here. A buttload of them. Like, pines for years. Every every tree possible in the history of possible every tree. I don't know if they grow over here. I don't really care. I just want trees for days. Except for this one. I don't really want a tree here. I want to know that they're lumberjack here. Yes. I don't know what I'm going to do with all these trees yet. I haven't thought that far into the future. I also have zero food. <laughs> as soon as I get a berry, it's devoured instantly. But I do have a ton of carrots. Maybe you guys should harvest. You ever think of doing that, Quarwuvan or Smikos? I do love this, though. We have, like, this really, really cool, like, extra village over here full of pine trees and a couple, like, tree killers. Except nobody's working over here yet. You know, for science purposes, I really just want to try it. <laughs> I, gotta, I gotta unlock the levee. I have to. And I have to build it. I just want to see what happens if we flood everything. We should have enough logs, because it only takes 12 each, and there's six of them, so that's 72 logs total. Oh! It did flood! Oh, that's so cool! Oh, no! <laughs> My poor people! My poor beavers! Oh, do they drown? Oh! <laughs> They're on top of the roof! Oh, that's adorable! Wow, and it doesn't flood a lot. Oh, that's pretty cool, because it goes back into the river here. Interesting! I wonder if they're going to add a flood season to the game. So, uh, I might have just ruined the save file. Um, <laughs> whoops. <laughs> so sorry, beaver people. I didn't, I actually, I did kind of mean, because it was, it was funny. <laughs> now they're all standing on top of their buildings. That's hilarious. Oh, if I delete these, does it work? Oh, yes. Okay, it kind of works. So, note to self. Do not, do not flood the entire world all at one time. Just a little bit of it. <laughs> anyway, guys, that'll do it for today's video. Hope you enjoyed Timberborn. If you did, let me know and keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time.